Hi everyone, I'm going to do some swatches now of the Tropic, the new makeup collection. So every year they seem to bring out, um, obviously bring out new products and that, but in time for Christmas they brought out a new, the new like gifts and things. So they've got the new Tropic guide, um, the luxury gift guide, and the gifts are actually really amazing this year. I've been doing Tropic now for two years and this is by far the nicest collection I've seen. Um, and the makeup as well, it's it's not bridal, it's not stuff I'm going to put in my kit because of the, I'll show you your colours and that, but it's really me, it's my kind of colours and I love them so I can't wait to use it. I'm just going to do some swatches, I will do a look with it later as well. I'm going to do it on here from a Tropic group first and then I will just, you know, share the video and things and that and look um, elsewhere as well, but I just wanted to do it for the Tropic group first. Um, so you can get a sneak peek and things like that of what it actually looks like. And this is my honest opinion, so I've never tried, I've not even tried any of this. I've opened it, looked at it, but I've not swatched it or looked at it, so this is an honest opinion. So I, I wasn't sure what even came in the collection, so there was this, you get the new palette. Uh, but this one, so it's got a magnified mirror, which is apparently, um, I've got another two of these and I actually haven't looked at the old mirror to see. But, um, so it's got this new magnified mirror, and I, on, in all honesty, I don't like a magnified mirror because, you know, you get them the two, you know, you get the mirrors and you turn them one way and they're like magnified, they're awful. But I don't know if it's just because there's nice lighting coming in, but actually, this is a really good mirror. It's quite surprising, but it's not as scary. It is magnified, but it's not as scary as what magnified mirrors can be. So I actually think it's a really good thing, especially, I don't want to say it, but now I'm getting a bit older, my eyesight is <laughs> not as great. And I actually think this is amazing and it's not harsh and it's not horrible, so it's a good sign. So I'm going to show you these. These are the, uh, the colours. How gorgeous are they? Now they're not bridal at all. I mean, well, I might use that smoky ones there, but you know, you didn't have bridal colours. The lipsticks are, but you know, I'm not going to use them for bridal, but I, they're actually really my colours. I love colours like that, so I'm totally going to use them. But how gorgeous is that? It should be. Um, but I would totally use that. So as I say, I'll do a look later with them, but I just want to swatch them first. So I'm going to go ahead and just do it on my arm. Um, hopefully the lighting's okay. It's coming in there. So I'm going to start at the bottom. And do the silver feel oh wow that's i don't know how to do this i never know how to do these swatches actually where did that go <laughs> i got too far down my arm right okay first swatch didn't go very well there it looks really pigmented there but it didn't on my hand but i'm just gonna do it properly that's better if you can see that first one that i done <laughs> ignore that one i don't know what happened there um so it's more it's i don't know how the light, the light's coming in i don't know if you can see it the way the light's coming in um, can't really see. Yeah, you can see it more there. That's the light getting it, and it's really nice. I mean, it's really pigmented there, but it doesn't go on. So it feels nice and creamy. So I'm going to go on now with the next color, which is slight darker. So that's. I'm not going too hard into them. So again, I'm just going to swipe that first. So that's still. It's not overly. I mean, I don't know. It's not overly pigmented um you know it doesn't go on you'd probably need to pick up quite a bit but it does feel really nice i'll just go over it a little bit oh, it does. i've just done a wee bit more and went over it i don't know if you can actually even see that first shade i mean i can see it here when the light's coming in i can definitely see it but so now i'm going to just damp my take this off <laughs> and go into the, the blue and the green are the ones i really like i love i mean blue though it's not a color you're but blue shimmery i love and the green i love a green so let's go in with the blue now. It feels really, I'm going to go a wee bit heavier this time, it feels really soft. So I'm just going to go in with that. So that's nice, I don't know if you can see the shimmer as well. They're actually really nice on, within that light coming in, they're not overly, you know sometimes you get some eyeshadows are really like, you just blend them, oh they do blend really nice, I think they would blend really well. I will go in again with that bottom one. That's the only one I've got an issue with at the moment and I can't really see um, clearly on the camera. So I'm actually, my fingers, I'm going to keep it a little bit damp. Sometimes if you pick it up uh, with damp, it's a little bit better. That's a bit better now. So I went over um, the first colour just a wee bit more and that is that is better. So I've just, my fingers a little bit damp from the uh, wipe. So, so far, they're looking really nice. I don't know how to swatch them. I don't know how to put them. The green. So now, this is a lovely, they just, I'm going to, again, they pick up really nice and they feel really nice. So I'm just going to swipe that on. Okay, so it's not quite as, hell yeah, it's a kind of lighter green right enough, isn't it? I'm going to put a wee bit more on because I feel like that just needs a little bit more. But I think it's just the colour, I suppose the lighter the colours, the more they're going to need, but that's that. 
they're not sort of shimmery again with the light coming in they're a bit shimmery they're not as shimmery as they look in the pans though so i think it maybe needs to be used a wee bit more so now i'm going to get this really lovely they're very christmas shades these very christmassy it's like a kind of red more the, <laughs> the color underneath it but it's kind of like a horror berry kind of color rusty red maybe i don't know that one's been on nice that one you can see a wee bit better again they're not too shimmery looking there but the light comes in them then they're, they're not shim they're not glittery that's the thing they do look quite glittery in there they're not they're more satiny but they've got a nice shimmer to them so aren't they really nice so you do need to you know i'd imagine you'll need a little you know to pick up a wee bit or put them on which i do with a lot of stuff is put it on with a damp um finger or damp sponge a uh, damp brush br put some setting spray on your brush and then put it in there and you find that a lot of like shimmers and those kind of shades that you want a pop of colour, you do need to use them a wee bit more damp. So that's really nice, though, aren't they? Really nice. So they do look. The green's more of a. Although it is, it does look the same as in there. It does look quite a. If you look at in there, it is quite a. Although it does look. I think it looks brighter and more vivid there on camera, but in real life they're not uh, the same there. But they're lovely, really nice. So I'm going to go into the eyeliners now. So this is, is this what, what's this one called? It's green, but I don't know what it's called actually. Um, now what I like about these are the, the, you don't sharpen them. So they're these little like, you know, the crayon type ones and you just twist them and they've got a wee sharpener, but at the end I think you can sharpen them. So if you do need to, you know, they're like the crayon things, I don't know how it comes out, but you can break that out and you can sharpen it. So I'm just gonna go on with, oh, now that's nice. Oh, I like that. I never take it. It's the angle I'm going at. How nice is that? Isn't that really nice? <laughs> I don't know how else to do this, but that oh, I really like that. That's a gorgeous green colour. That so that with that green would be nice. But even I like that in its own. It's so much deeper. It's not shimmery or anything, but it's so much deeper. I do like that one. Looking forward to using that. It should they don't go right down? I don't think. Oh, they're outside cutting grass or something it's not even a nice it's not even a nice day for it it's like been raining and every time it rains they seem to go out and cut the grass and the edges so this one is i don't see the colors what it says it's probably in the box actually it looks like a kind of purpley plum oh it does say like midnight plum so what was this one um rainforest green i like that so midnight plum so Wow, wow, these are really intense, these. <laughs> My arm's getting further and further back. How intense are these? <laughs> they are way more intense than I was actually expecting, but I really do like that. They all go on really nicely. And finally, I've got the blue one. Blue, again, it's not a colour I tend to really use, and that's called Ocean Dusk. Give that a shot. They go on really, really nicely, but they are like this. They're called silk gel liner, so they're really nice to go on. They're not like a pencil, they don't tug, they go on really smooth, as you can see. I'm really impressed with that. So, I will create some looks with these. So, now I'm going to swatch the lipsticks. So, I should have a little. Use my. Oh, I'm just not going to straighten it. I'm just going to use my wee spatula. I don't know the colour names. I should have really got them, but I don't know the colour names. So, I've kind of run out of room in my arm, but I'll keep going. <laughs> I'll just go higher up my arm. Um, so this is the first one, I think this is Coco something it's called. Wow, really creamy. So it's that one there. Really creamy that, isn't it? Wow. Not that you can see that, I'm seeing that. <laughs> but it is really creamy. And then the next one, I think this was a... Oh, I can't remember the name of this one. This is one I wasn't sure about. I didn't really like the look of it on myself because I thought it looks really really like pink it, it reminds me of like a frosty kind of pink but it'll be interesting to see what it's actually like it looks different in the pan what it's like on the skin oh it's actually it's actually different to what i thought it was gonna be <laughs> it's quite i don't know it looks really pale pink when you see it online but actually it's a little bit deeper it's maybe more of a kind of duskier kind of pink colour. It's quite similar to the eyeshadow colour actually. And then this one, again I don't know what this one's called. I should really have done that first. 
I'm just using a tiny bit. So that one is, that one's a bit more, um, I would say a bit more sheer than the first, especially than the first one, that's much more sheer. It's kind of not going on the same, I don't find. I'm needing to use a wee bit more. It feels more like, a, um, yeah, it's definitely more sheer than the others. It's definitely more sheer. <laughs> Last one. <laughs> now I'm running out of room in my arm. I will take a photo in the light with it as well and add that on. This one I like the look of. I don't know what that's called, but it's a bit deeper. Um, I don't know what that's called. Oh, I like that one. That's maybe more, oh, I do like that shade. That's a nice one, that very end one is, I don't, again, I'll have to get the names, I will get the names of them, but I do really like that. So there you go, there's the swatches. So the eyeshadows, quite sheer, you would need to, I would use them wet. I'd definitely use a damp or a damp finger um, and pick them up and swipe them on. I think it'd be really nice with that. I think my favourite one is the silvery one, the very first one. I would say for me personally, I quite like that. The blue and the green, are, they look more intense there, they're not, again, you build it up, but I mean, we're not for them as much, but definitely the silver one. The eyeliners, love them, love all three of them, really nice. And the lipsticks, I would say the first and the last one are my favourites, but that's just a personal choice, and they just swatched really well. So, I will just take some photos now and try and get that in the daylight of my arm, it's going to be quite difficult, <laughs> I'll try and do that. And then I will do some looks with it once I've washed my hair. <laughs> Any questions, if you want to know any more about the collection, and I've got the wee, I've got loads of wee, um, the gift guides here. If you want any, I can drop them off or you can collect them. Let me know, but I hope that was of some use. <laughs> I can maybe see the light better there. <laughs> Thanks, see you later, bye.